How's it going, bros? Uh, welcome to a We Ran Out of Medals gameplay, which is a medal for getting a 25 kill streak in Crucible. Uh, I heard about this medal and was wondering why I hadn't had one come up for previous streaks, but discovered it was added in with the Taken King DLC, uh, along with the Phantom Medal, etc. Um, so apparently, this is the first 25 streak I've had since uh, TTK came out. Sad times. Uh, anyway, I made it relatively speedy. Uh, I started off the video from the first kill of the streak. Uh, I died a couple of times at the start. But it's about 4 minutes to the 25th kill. Uh, and the final kill is about as close as it gets to dying at the last hurdle. I was about an inch away from some serious rage. Uh, I didn't know what streak I was on at the time. But I would have checked afterwards and I would have been seriously mad. Uh, but as it is, it makes for a pretty Hollywood finish. Uh, but after that's done with, I've left the rest of the match in the video. A uh, pretty fun game, I actually just went in and just went on for kind of all out kills and ignored the objective. I didn't even really see what the score was until the end, but I don't think the flags really mattered uh, all that much because we just out slayed them pretty hard. And at this point we kind of have the good spawn around the sea end which kind of lets me set up in the tunnel. And at this point you can kind of just look at their spawn onto A. And as long as you can hold this tunnel, you can rack up a ton of kills. See, a lot of my teammates are down there, keeping them occupied. And I can just sit up on this ledge and pinch them off as they're trying to run out of the tunnel spawn. Uh, right now, I'm kind of panicking a little bit. Uh, pop a golden gun, because there's a lot of my radar suddenly went red. Uh, fortunately, that guy didn't have a shotgun. I assumed he would, because he was rushing me, but I think he was going for a melee or something. Uh, heavy's coming in at this point, so I'll start working my way back. Uh, but one thing to always remember with Heavy on this map is some pleb will always try and push you through the tunnel, so throw a trip mine down, you're almost guaranteed to get a kill. And sure enough, somebody tries to run through and gets me my rain. Uh, this guy wasn't really too sure, he never really know after Heavy how many people are going to have rocket launchers and how many people are going to have machine guns. Fortunately with the Taken King there's so many good primaries. Uh, which are legendary now that you don't have to have an exotic primary which kind of frees up exotics to be used elsewhere which means I can use a Thunderlord as my machine gun um, simply because I've got one which dropped at 310 damage uh, which is very cool, uh, it's not quite as good as the old school BTRD if you ask me but uh, as machine guns go in the new kind of era uh, it's probably the best one you can be running to keep your light level up at the same time uh, so then just retake the same perch as I had. Uh, here Golden Gun go off, so I kind of retreat, but it turns out to be a teammate. Uh, one guy there just running after him, trying to kill him, I think, with a shotgun. And then same thing here, everyone seems to be ignoring me. Uh, could argue that I got a little bit lucky here. Almost managed to kill myself with a uh, Vortex Grenade, which would have been slightly embarrassing. Uh, these two guys get a little bit blindsided. Again, it's very easy to spawn trap on this map, as long as you keep the kind of C spawn. Uh, the A spawn is absolute hell to get out of, uh, which is one reason I don't particularly like this map. Uh, this golden gun is a complete whiff. Uh, I kind of heard the hammers go off and I thought he might be right behind me. Saw him over there. Uh, obviously, Hammer of Soul is just completely overpowered right now in terms of the health and damage resistance you get. So he only took about half damage from that first golden gun. The second one I just kind of missed. And the third one I d missed as well, I guess. Uh, looking for the guy on C, can't really see him. Uh, not jo not gonna lie, panicking a little bit at this point, getting the, getting the shakes. Uh, so I was like, ah, oh, I could actually be nearer. We ran out of medals by now. Uh, yep, yeah, as you can see, sniping's gone way downhill. Uh, see the golden going guy there. Had another one go off. Was a little bit nervous. This time it is an enemy. I uh, know it's going to be him there, throw down a trip mine, and here we go, this is what I was talking about, the Hollywood finish, fires a shot, just about misses me, knife him for the 25th kill, and that trip mine is a nice bonus, takes out the guy backing him up, uh, this pulse rifle absolutely shredding by the way, it's a lot like the, oh, yeah it's uploaded clip as well, just to the friends feed, uh, this pulse rifle by the way, uh, it's basically no one's mercy if you got the no one's mercy from the iron banner it's the exact same stats almost except with bottom half the clip with extra damage and the uh, I think it's the head seeker it's called perk body shots increase uh, precision damage so it's basically the mercy but with better stats uh, it's called the villainy from future walkout 
I've only been killed by it a couple of times, so nobody seems to be using it. But I'll definitely look into it. If you like the No One's Mercy, I'll definitely look into getting this. Um, I'm not sure if those stats come as standard. I mean, those rolls come as standard, sorry. Because I didn't buy this from them. Uh, it dropped randomly from a package. Uh, so, I don't know. Uh, the stats basically come out the same. I mean, the base stats. Uh, but the rolls can come out better. And then, of course, that... Uh, Yasmin for the sniper rifle, which I didn't think was going to be a very good PvP sniper, and I randomly tried it because I left it on by mistake. Um, it turns out I'm actually a lot better with it than I am with the thousand yards down. Unfortunately, it doesn't have the impact to one shot through overshield, so I'm going to have to keep half decent with the stair just so I can use it during a Cyrus and stuff uh, just to kill those revives. But uh, for general use, I think the Yasmin is actually a lot better. Uh, anyway, that's pretty much a streak. As I said, the rest of the games in here, I just kind of went for the highest score I could at this point. Uh, finished just over 8k. It's really little 360 there. Swag YOLO. Uh, otherwise, that's about it. Um, so thanks for watching. And I will see you next time. Enemy captured zone C. Zone B neutralized. Enemy captured zone A. Zone B secure. Victory imminent. Nice work, Guardians. Your efforts have been noted.